What's up guys? We're tired of pretty much being in quarantine by ourselves. So I invited my entire family that Morgan hasn't met yet before this down to this amazing spot here in Southern Utah. It's probably 30 minutes outside of where I live and it is a epic, epic place to stay. Not just the pool, but there's two casitas, there's sleeps 31 people, the bunk beds, the two kitchens, and then obviously the backyard is just absolutely insane. So we're gonna be out here just having a good time with family, but before we do that, we gotta get in a battle of the sexes. It's gonna utilize this entire backyard from the pool with the awesome rock platforms, the putt-putt course, the basketball hoop, and some other things in there. So we're gonna get into and do that. But uh, yeah, it's been an amazing kind of time with family. I got a big family, huh? Yeah. <laughs> we literally have filled out this whole place and it sleeps 31. Yeah. I'm one of seven and uh, all of my brothers and sisters are pretty much married, um, except for one, and have, yeah, and have kids. So we are like 26 people deep in this place. So welcome to the vlog. It's gonna be a test of Skills, Everything. speed, Skills and just pure know. luck. First and foremost, we have the basketball court. On the basketball court, you gotta make a layup straight into a free throw. I wanted to go three-pointer, but seeing as if Morgan's never played basketball, it wasn't really fair for that. It really wasn't. Okay. <laughs> so we're going, we're gonna make this as fair as possible. Throw, let's see your free throw skills right now. That's the free throw skill right now. Let's see it. She did play. Morgan did play netball. And this is a girl's ball, so. Oh, see? It's not gonna be pretty. Which makes me a little bit happy. <laughs> what makes you a little bit happy? Oh, ah! what? We watched the Jordan documentary and now. I bought my first, first pair of Jordans and I wanna play basketball. This is how we do it, this is how Jordan does it. All right. So you gotta make layup and free throw. As soon as you're done. Boom, you're running, you're fast walking, you're over here to handstand walk. You wanna show them how to handstand walk across this? Far out, you make that look so easy. That's gonna be a struggle for me. I'm gonna be struggle bus. So I, I need to clarify a rule here. If you fall down, do you start over or do you just kick up from where you're at? Um, this is gonna be the decider whether you win or not, I think. Really? Yeah, because I think this is the only thing I'm going to get ahead of you on. I think she's talking. She's being too nice. She's going to she's gonna probably whoop my butt in this. I think you can go from where you are. Okay. That's, that's very kind of you. You get to over to here. Boom. Grab your putter. One, two, three, four. Oh my gosh. That's a lot more. <sighs> that's dizzy. Then you got to walk over here and then you got to sink a putt, which is actually a lot harder than it looks like. Get in the hole. There you go. As soon as you sink your putt, you're moving on to double shot. Bum, bum, bum. Basically, you have to make 20 baskets. Any way you want, 20 baskets, and then you're on to the next obstacle. Run, walk, do whatever you can to get over to the pool. Now, once you're in the pool, even though we're going for time, you can't dive in. Step in gently, because there's no jumping into this side of the pool. Swim, 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 all the way to the deep end. It's only four feet deep here, but then right about here, it drops off like crazy. And it is deep, about 12, 12 to 13 feet deep. We're gonna have a ring at the bottom of the pool. See it ring at the bottom of the pool that you will have to retrieve. Should you have to make the ring? This is me making it up. Should you have to pull the ring out and make it onto something? Like a bottle of sunscreen. Yeah. I'm just making this hotter as we rules. go. <laughs> you get out of the pool, you make your ring, boom! Now you're down to the last obstacle. This is also one of the coolest ones. Boom, it's a maze. It's amazing here. There's a grotto to the left, but we're passing the grotto. We're coming up the stairs. We're coming underneath. Watch out for the low hanging rock. Spin around, jump up, parkour, parkour. Not Parker, but parkour. <laughs> and then underneath 
the tunnel of terror around the rattlesnake up to this platform where you must perform a sick ass backflip bro just chuck it send it chest to the sun throwing up shakas whatever you want to do the sickest backflip you've ever seen land get out time is done we're gonna go find out who goes first and then one of us will set the time the other one will try to beat it this is battle of the sexes backyard edition all right guys so now we're gonna rock paper scissors to see who goes first in this fourth installment of battle of the sexes rock paper scissors shoot i love that this is also an australian game ready rock paper scissors shoot you get first I knew that was coming. All right, guys, this is the time you need to decide. Are you gonna cheer for me, or are you gonna cheer for Morgan? <laughs> my own family, my own family. All right, here I go. Start, start on my first movement. How do you feel like that went? That was rough. The, the, the putting, the hoop shoot was awful. I was still dizzy. Okay, Morgan, how do you feel? A bit nervous, to be honest. I'm nervous about this. Everything else I'm fine with. Everything else. Yeah, I think I'm good with everything else. Actually, maybe that. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> hey. What? Best of luck. What is that?
29.7. Yeah. Yeah. She's a weapon. We knew that. And I suck at double shot, apparently. Double shot. Bum, bum, bum. All I know, I'm absolutely awful at this. And I didn't always be awful at this. So I'm out here trying to get my game back. Everyone else pretty much went in. I lost. I was forced to... Uh, admit my girlfriend's better at hoop shoot and everything else that I just did. So I'm out here practicing, but pretty much, uh, yeah, Morgan hates losing as much as I do, maybe even more. So my family knows how competitive I am. They saw it firsthand growing up. I wasn't always the most gracious winner or loser, so they love seeing me lose, but it's fun for them to see how competitive Morgan is too. So now, since it's afternoon, basically we barbecue, we swim, we all play games of pig, putt-putt, and double shot. We're just one big competitive family, and uh, it's good. Now that we're all older, there's a lot less tears when people lose, especially to your girlfriend. I'm not crying. Jordan. Yeah, what's up? <laughs> thumbs up for my weapon of a girlfriend. <laughs> if you like this one, let us know which one you want to see next, Battle of the Sexes Edition. Next one might be on our couples channel. That's the come. Stay tuned. How disgusting is that? We're going to have a couples channel. Isn't that disgusting? <laughs> <laughs>